Good morning and welcome to Meadowlands Farm. It is Thursday, the 18th day of winter, and the fortune teller says, oh, the spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. Okay, so we did pass out last night, so we'll probably have a letter. Oh. Okay, so George has sent us a recipe for fried eel. And... Jody has sent us a recipe for fried calamari. This is probably as a result of us completing the community center. Uh, Pierre has sent us a recipe for blueberry tart. Wow. <laughs> Caroline sent us a recipe for parsnip soup. Gus, recipe for salmon dinner. Pam, recipe for cheese cauliflower. Demetrius, recipe for autumn's bounty. Linus, the sashimi recipe. Marnie, the pale broth recipe. Krobus. I'm not sure how the human message system works, so I asked Wizard to help me write this letter. I hope you are doing okay. I wanted to share this with you. It's notes on how my people build a certain item. New crafting recipe for the dark sign. And Willie, recipe for chowder. This is great. Clint, a recipe for algae soup. Okay, Marlin found us face down in the mud during my 3 a.m. sweep. You should try to make it home a little earlier next time. Well, that's nice. I guess we didn't lose any money if it's Marlin. Pierre's General Store is now open seven days a week. Willie, I've unlocked the back room of the shop. Come by when you have a chance. There's something I want to show you. And this, oh, okay. Dear Dink, I would like to give you some information about an upcoming event, the Feast of the Winter Star. It's time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. A favorite tradition is the secret gift exchange, where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprises them with something special. This year, your secret friend is... Penny, don't tell anyone. The feast will take place on the 25th from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the town square. See you there. All right, that was a lot of mail to get through. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is check and see if we can still do the squid quest for it was either Willie or it was somebody. It looks like not. Okay. Oh, today is the final day for the lava crabs, and we have four days for juicy bugs. All right, so we are definitely going to go to the mines today. I also wanted to drop by Robin's and get a fish pond. Oh, let me pick up the rest of this clay from the other day. And these mystery boxes. And we've got some maple syrup over here. All right, I think this part of the farm is so ugly. I really want to change it all up. But I think for now, I'm just going to, like, stick a random fish pond over here somewhere. Oh, all our oak resin is up, too. Okay, I even hate all these little tree seeds around here that are just too close to each other. Oh, my inventory's full again. There's another mushroom tree seed. All right, let me put some of this stuff away. Oh yeah, part of the problem is I haven't Emptied my pockets from my fishing last night. Okay, let's run over here. And I want to put the super cucumber in here and grab this crab pot out. So I, I wasted a thousand bucks on this squid for nothing, but oh well. I need a bigger marine chest. 
Okay, let's run over here. Yeah, this is empty, so... Do I want to... I don't really need to keep this marine chest over here, do I? Uh, I don't, so you know what? I'm going to run this back over here. And I will... No, you know what? I don't want to do that. There is a reason that I kept this over here. And it's because I don't want to accidentally use up fish that I'm... Use up fish that I'm saving in recipes. So, all right, I'm going to throw the blobfish in here because I'm definitely saving him. And the sea jelly. Uh, I need... Five green algae and five seaweed for the fish pond. I'm going to keep one midnight squid and sell the rest. Oh, I have plenty of squid, so I have five gold squid and three iridium. Why am I keeping all this? I have three periwinkle. I need two more. I'll save a spook fish and sell one. Okay, empty this inventory out a little bit. Okay, I need stone for the fish pond. this crab pot down and put the bait in here hopefully get a couple more periwinkle out of that what time is it 10 30 okay oh we've got a ancient fruit and we will throw that right into the seed maker and hope for the best and let me put this iridium sprinkler down. No. There we go. And we got two ancient fruit seeds. Okay, so... I'm going to be changing this around soon, so let me one, two, one, two. So a sprinkler will go here, so I want to make sure I don't plant anything there. So we'll throw the ancient fruit seeds down there. Oh, our oranges are up. Okay. So I have 16 blueberry seeds. I think I bought 16 because I was planning on doing the regular, these, you know, quality sprinklers to make eight, but 
I didn't do that, so it messed me up a little bit. Okay, we'll water these, and then we'll head over to Robin. Oh, we have to check our animals first. Hello, everybody. Got a duck feather. Oh, and a dinosaur egg. So we can take that to... That dinosaur looks too small to be laying eggs, but we can take that to Gunther now. Say hello to these guys. And I didn't get any of their milk or anything. It's, oh my gosh, it's four o'clock already. Okay, I'm just gonna keep this stuff on me and run to Robin and hope I can get her before she closes. I think she closes at five, not four, right? Just have to ignore everything we see on the way. Four thirty. Hopefully, we have plenty of time. Oh, another cutscene. Demetrius, I didn't tell you to get tomatoes. I said to get fruit. I don't understand. Tomatoes are fruits. When a normal person says they want fruit, they never mean tomatoes. It doesn't matter what the scientific classification is. Dink, I'm glad you're here. You'll be able to put this argument to rest. How would you classify a tomato? I really hate this argument. I'm going to say fruit. See, Dink agrees with me. I just want you to understand my point of view. It's hard for me to know exactly what assumptions I should make when you tell me something. But I'll try to get better at it. Thanks for your help, Dink. I mean, yeah, technically. I feel like Robin was being a little bit mean there, but I can see how she would be a little annoyed sometimes. Um... You know, I know that they did this with Clint, that you can still shop after putting in an order, but I'm not sure if they did it with her. So, while I'm here, I'm going to buy the calendar, because I'm missing everybody's birthdays. And I want to buy a recipe for some better flooring, I think. Wood floor, rustic plank floor. You know what, they're so cheap. Maybe I'll just get all of them. Okay. And construct farm buildings. We're going to go for a fish pond. And next is the big shed, but that's a pretty big outlay of money, so I'm going to wait until I have a little more money. I think I'll put it over here. Should I kind of line it up with the uh, fence? Okay. Now I'm going to head to the mines and try and work on these, <laughs> these quests that I took. Oh, the bubbles. 
I'll have to ignore the bubbles. Okay, so I'm going to put some stuff away in case something weird happens and I pass out and I don't want to lose any of this. I don't know how I have 30 green algae. I must have, must have taken it all somehow. Okay, I'm going to eat some pumpkin soup for luck. And I also needed a top-up of my energy. Oh, I really want that cave jelly, but I think I'm going to have to go with the lava crab floor. Are you a crab? Nope. Nope. Are you a crab? Nope. Well, I got a couple of stairwells. Okay, no lava crabs here. Not seeing any bugs either. Lava crabs. Lots of possibilities for them here. Um, so I've got luck and defense going, but I'm going to drink a triple shot espresso and get a little bit of speed. Got a stairway too. He was still alive. There's one. Oh, I got a bomb. Okay, let me eat this bread. doubt these will be more right away, but I'm going to check them anyway. Anything else to eat? Hmm. I think I'm going to run upstairs. Check here. See if I have anything. <laughs> oh, I have plenty of blackberries. 
Okay, 11 blackberries later, we are back to full health. And we got ourselves a jade. And we need gold too, so this is great. And I think we also still need copper. time already. I don't want to pass out two nights in a row. I'm sad that we didn't get the uh, either of these quests done today. Oh, hang on a sec. Nope. <laughs> Look at all this gold. Time to head home. I hate to pass out two days in a row, but looks like we're going to have to. And I abandoned my horse. <laughs> oh, we might make it. Let me just, uh, oh, I left a bunch of stuff in my chest over at the mine. Okay, I'm going to try and grab this and put some of this stuff away. Well, I'm happy with some of the stuff I got done today. I was able to plant all my blueberries and bait the crab pots for the periwinkles and go to Robin and buy the fish pond. Oh. So the mines will have to wait until tomorrow again for the bug meat, the lava crab, which actually I think that was the last day for that today, and also the cave jelly that we need to make the smoker to get the smoke perch to the raccoon family. So thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. Hope you join me again. Until then, stay safe and take care. Bye-bye.